You've likely already noticed, but enforcement on State Route 347 is getting some heightened attention. State troopers and the Arizona Department of Public Safety are increasing patrols and issuing citations to drivers flagrantly flaunting the rules of the road. And it's something Maricopa residents have been requesting for quite some time. ADOT, DPS, and Mayor Smith all stress that equally important as taking these safety steps is impressing upon drivers the importance of good behavior behind the wheel. Keeping our firefighters safe goes well beyond the flames. Maricopa firefighters are giving us a look at a cancer fighting tool in their arsenal. It's called Stormstick, a decontamination unit that firefighters set up when they go out on calls so they can scrub down with a detergent solution and remove a majority of the hydrocarbons, heavy metals, and soot they may carry out of a fire. Those carcinogens are a leading cause of line of duty death for firefighters, and this tool is just one way the city of Maricopa is working to lower that risk to our first responders. And finally, some of Maricopa's youth are finding ways to bring civics classes to life. Maricopa High School senior Dominic Mazuski is just one of the participants in the city's Citizen Leadership Academy. This four session course is helping Dominic and his fellow classmates understand what it takes to build and run a city. Honestly, I didn't know how genuinely amazing our, our public safety program is. That was, that was in session two. Uh, I knew that we focused a lot on fire and police and medical, but I didn't know that I didn't know how extensive it was and how how much how much time and training goes into that. The, the police chief was talking about mental health days for his officers, and I, I just I thought it was amazing the direction we're going in with that. Thanks for tuning into this week's episode. For more news around your city, be sure to hit that subscribe button and subscribe to our weekly newsletter at maricopa-az.gov/newsletter.